they're ready to hit the throttles. Chevrolet's in the front row. Down they come. The green is out bottom part. It is Mike Bruce, Sokolik riding one and two. Sokolik getting up there a little bit wide. Greg O'Connor moving down onto the inside, taking away the number two spot. Barry Kingsley, car number 91. He shuffles to the outside. Look at Jack Patrick. In car number nine, he goes to the outside. Also, Camden Proud in car number 54, shuffling also to the outside. It is Bruce, the leader, goes quick with a 19.374. O'Connor running second, Camden Proud third, Dalton Doyle, Sokolik. Rounding out the top five as they stretch it down the back straightaway. Jack Patrick has moved up to the number five position. A battle right now with Camden Proud in car number 54 on the inside. Camden works the inside part of the speedway, and it looks like he has taken over that number two spot. Camden is now up to second, O'Connor third, Dalton Doyle running fourth, Jack Patrick hot back there in the number five spot. Here is Patrick, but look who is right behind him. It's the number 74, Mike Bond. And Bondi looking up onto the outside. Now on the inside, he switched lanes down to between the corners. Camden Proud turning a quick lap of an 18.854. They work off a of turn number two. And now Bond has moved into the top five. Doyle, Patrick, Bond, Lasorto, freight training. Here is Mike Bond again. Mike off a of turn two. He has been knocking on the door all night long. And Bondi taking a look on the inside of Jack Patrick. He is now solid up into that number four spot. They're gonna be bringing it across the line. Bond is now fourth, and Bond is on the move, and look who is closing in also. Anthony Lasorto has picked up the number five spot. Anthony Lasorto now fifth, Jack Patrick back to sixth. They bring it down here into turn number one. And we got trouble down onto the inside. It is the Camden Proud car getting up a little bit wide in car number 54. This is, causes him to go back at least two spots as they bring it off at of turn four to complete and have 13 laps to go. Now, Mike Bond is up to third. Lasorto is running fourth. Third place running car, Mike Bond. Bond in the 74, and we've got yellow. It's Shartner in car number 18 on the inside of turn number two. Our first caution of the night. Who's still up there in the number one spot, Brucey. And look at Anthony Lasorto riding up onto the outside. As I always say, down to between three and four. Scorers stand by. Down they come, the checkered flag is out. And the double deuce of Mike Bruce takes the win. He is Mr. Small Block Super Modified. Puts on the Hoosier band, gets the hat. Mike Bruce, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. SBS for, 19, for 2018. It's been two years or more since he's won. Uh, 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 I don't know. I, I knew our car was, was good enough that we could, we could stay up front. It was just a matter of how rough they were going to run, but I don't mind bumping and, and rubbing and, and going for the win. So. Doyle gave me a few taps, let me know he was there, but it was all through the straightaway, and uh, if anything, it helped me get going. He kept my momentum up. He probably could have drove right underneath me. So I started losing some of our oil pressure towards the end. It was down to about 40, but uh, uh, she held together. So we blew up the engine last week. Uh, we had uh, redid our spare motor from last year. Uh, we threw it in. These guys, <coughs> these guys here, they uh, busted their butts all, all week. Last night, we were in the shop all night, all day, till we loaded up and came here. and. Uh, Doug Holmes helped us out today, uh, setting up some stuff for the engine, and it's just, uh, racing's one of the most emotional sports there is, and uh, it's, it's been long, <clears throat> it's been a long uh, season, and uh, I can't thank everybody that's uh, stood behind me, Woodchucks, Millennium Music, and uh, my family, crew with Carly, uh, just good to be back in victory lane. Off that fourth corner, green is out from Bernie Finnegan. And it is Connors on the inside. And oh my word, he gets caught up right away. Several cars spinning. Connors is out of the action. Bellinger will be out of the action. As Connors and Thompson brush together down here in the corner, trying to hang on to the lead, trying to get the lead here on lap number one. I believe Brandon Bellinger did. And we're going to need the hook, I believe, for the 0-1 of Danny Connors. 
Green flag from Bernie Finnegan. And Abel trying to get out in front. Thompson digging deep down to the inside. They go side by side down the back straight. And Abel takes the lead. Dave Gruel got out of shape coming out of turn two. Made a good save on that number 50 look at Otto Sitterly. Sitterly behind Michael Barnes. The hustler on the outside. Sitterly on the outside with him. At the end of lap number one, it is Abel out in front. Tyler Thompson running second. Here's a battle for fourth. Third is Dave Dancer with a 68 of Barnes. Here is Sitterly on the outside on the charge. Comes around and takes over the number two spot. Barnes now going to try to follow through out there. Sitterly on the outside. Sitterly around Abel takes over the lead. Otto Sitterly now out in front in that number seven with three laps down. Long, long way to go yet. Has uh, put him into the pit area. Now here's the 68 of Barnes working the outside of Abel. Could not make it happen down between one and two. Meanwhile, Shula continues to work on the 98 of Thompson. Here's Barnes on the outside. Michael Barnes on the outside of the number 05 and takes over the runner-up spot. It's Sitterly out in front. Barnes running second. Abel is third. Meanwhile, Abold has caught up to the 66 of LeVay, goes down to the inside and puts LeVay a lap down. Here's Schulich now on the inside of the 98 of Tyler Thompson. Thompson trying to battle back on the outside. That does not work. Thompson loses the spot. Schulich now moves up to the number four spot. Otto Sitterly out in front as Didero just got by. Danzer moves up into the number eight spot. Sitterly now, heavy, heavy traffic ahead. Goes to the outside of teammate Davey Hamilton. Hamilton, meanwhile, working on the 55 of Champagne. We got a car in trouble. That's going to bring out the yellow flag. 46 laps have been completed. 47 have been completed. Here comes the 50 of Gruel. Thompson way high down here, but Gruel took him. Here comes Hamilton down to the inside. Hamilton going to go by Thompson as well. So Thompson loses two spots on that left. Trying to battle back on the outside. He gives another spot away. Champagne down to the inside. So a big shakeup in the top 10. Still, it's the seven of Otto Sinterly out in front. 68, Michael Barnes running second. Sinterly now down to the inside into turn number three. Puts the 98 of Thompson a lap down. And now there are just five cars on the lead lap. Five cars remaining on the lead lap. The next one ahead of, uh, and I'm not sure he'll catch it with 12 to go, is the 50 of Dave Gruel. Schulich or Champagne dropping down one lap as he got passed on that a couple of laps ago by race leader Otto Sitterly. Sitterly out in front, closing in again on the number one of Jeff West. West, a difficult guy to pass. Goes a little bit high between one and two. Sitterly taking his time. Yellow flag is out. Car up against the wall. That is Lou LeVay Sr. LeVay Sr. up against the wall in between three and four. He's got to coast around. There's the checkered flag. The win to Otto Sitterly. Michael Barnes in second. Dave Schulich is third. And here he comes, ladies and gentlemen, Otto Sitterly, Mr. Super Modified for 2018. Way to go, Otto. Um, I always like the cushion of the lap cars before the last 10, but rules are the rules. It's been that way forever, so it, it was fine. I could tell the car was hooked up pretty good. It, it just got a little tight at the end, and that seems to be the problem with this car, but we've sort of each week been chipping at it, and... Uh, Knocked the wall down a couple times with it last week, but it doesn't seem to hurt it. I think everybody else was tight too, so just uh, we had a good starting spot. We got some breaks early and got up to second, but I mean, you can obviously see how class of the field he was, and my hat's off to him. Uh, he deserves it. He did a great job. Uh, tonight was frustrating. Uh, I flat ass missed it. Um, we had two inches of stagger coming in, and the thing was a dump truck. But uh, salvage a third place with that car uh, tonight was uh, a win for us. Congratulations to Otto and Seven Car on their win, big win tonight. And, uh, you know, we'll go home and uh, make it better for the next time.